And Don, you were talking earlier about the difference between Hurricane Ian versus it becoming what is now post tropical cyclone Ian going from a warm core to a cold core. And we're really feeling that here. Look at this 17 degree temperature difference 71 in Goldsboro, but 54 degrees right now in Roxboro. Temperature hasn't changed all that much today. 56 in Oxford, 62 Raleigh, 61 degrees in Durham, 68 though in Fayetteville, and 69 degrees in Clinton. Here are our current wind gusts, the highest wind gusts so far today in the triangle. The wind gusting almost up to 50 miles per hour at RDU International. The peak wind gust so far today, 48. Fayetteville up to 56 miles per hour. In Maxton, we saw wind gusting up to 59. In Roxborough, 41. So Roxborough not getting as high of winds as other places and certainly not as much rain, which was expected. The worst of it being in the Sand Hills. Goldsboro up to 46. Southern Pines, there's an update 44 miles per hour for your highest wind gusts today and Rocky Mount 46 miles per hour and we're not done just yet. Currently here are the wind speeds different from wind gust to get a wind speed. You want to take different observations of the wind and then you average it over a two minute period. So this is your wind speed sustained sustained at 30 miles per hour in Raleigh, so certainly breezy here. 22 Roxboro, 21 in Irwin, 23 Fayetteville and 20 miles per hour for your sustained wind speed in Clinton. And here's the wind gust winds gusting up to 45 in Durham, 39 in Raleigh, 39 in Fayetteville, whereas earlier we had a wind gust of 56 in Fayetteville, 38 at the Rocky Mount Wilson Airport and 21 in Goldsboro and still plenty more hours to go. Here's 11 o'clock tonight. Still, we'll be talking about winds gusting up upwards of 30 40 miles per hour plus and then the winds really slacken for tomorrow. Tomorrow 8 o'clock in the morning winds gusting as high as 20 to 25 miles per hour. Notice that circulation. That's where the center of Ian should be closer to Roxborough by about 8 o'clock tomorrow morning. Then we take you into tomorrow afternoon. Here's 430 winds shifting out of the northwest and then out of the west gusting up to 20 miles per hour for tomorrow afternoon and really calming down by tomorrow night. Here's 9 o'clock with with winds gusting only as high as 15 miles per hour. Worst case scenario there, so certainly a windy day today. Not nearly as windy for tomorrow, Don. Tomorrow and really for much of the weekend, looking better and a little brighter, especially so for tomorrow. It's